There is a vine zombie around here somewhere though. Maybe it's when you come back from here. I actually can't quite remember. Not nice. More white powder. Sick. Oh, nice. Somebody's note. Everybody's turned. Vegified. Nice. They keep coming back again and again. Burn them all. Burn them until their whole body is black as ash. There's no other way. Oof. Fuck. It's a bit brutal. Oh, shut the fuck up, you dirty bitch. Oh, yes. Nice. I fucking shut her up. Alright. Oh, yeah. It just leads you back into here, doesn't it? Alright, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna attempt to go downstairs and hopefully not get mad in the process. So, um, yeah, wish me luck, everyone. Ooh, shit. Ah, oh, what? I would have thought, because he's stunned, he would have not got me there. That was a bit bullshit. Wait, you're down. Fuck you. Fuck you. Wait, fuck you. <laughs> shit. Alright, I'm down to the last mag on my pistol. This should be interesting. Where the fuck is that? Uh, oh, yeah, it's through here, isn't it? Come on, Claire. You got this. Oh, no. Go away. You'll be dead by now. I mean, you already are dead, but I mean, like, actual dead dead. Not like, you know, walking about and like, bleh. Fucking ugly bastards. Right, Murph. That's the one we need to set it to. Uh... Now, I remember when the, um, I first played this as well, this was a bit of a piss day getting fucking sorted, but once you figure it out, it's really easy, so. Here we go. Hey, light. Yes, I can fucking finally see now. Right, let's go in that fucking low temperature room. I can't remember if there's a, if there's a healing item. Oh, you fucking ugly bastard. You ugly fucker. You ugly, ugly cunt. Fuck you. Get fucked. Go fuck yourself. There we go. I felt justified in putting that many bullets, bullets into him. <laughs> oh, yeah, there's a knife in here, isn't there? Oh, nice. Some more fucking white pooder. And some fucking... And some fucking... What do you call it? Flame rounds. Nice. Oh, yeah, it's the save room, isn't it? Right. I not need to go in here. I need to go... Not here. Over here. I don't know why this bit isn't lighted up for some fucking strange reason. I mean, at least they light up this bit, I suppose. So that's kind of good. Right. Uh, is there anything here? Because I'm pretty sure there is something I can pick up here. Wait, where is it? Okay, it's nothing. I'm sure, I thought. I thought it was, Oh no, I'm thinking of um, Leon. Uh, the second playthrough where you find the 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 fucking trophies there. So that's what I'm thinking of. <laughs> I mean, it'd be interesting to see uh, play the first run again, because I have to admit, I these days I only really play the first run now. I don't really play the second run that much. I do like the second run, because you obviously get the end with Birkin, and, and you fight him at the end, and everything is really good. But I just think there's a lot... I think it's it's really drawn out in the sense, of, like, you you got a lot of bat boss battles to deal with, and you don't really quite get... You don't get, like, slightly more ammo than you really should than your first play. You're basically got the same amount of ammo you would in your first playthrough, which I think is really, really stupid. Because, I mean, like, yeah, I don't mind the game being difficult, but when it's difficult to the point where you literally have no fucking ammo because you can't, you've just, you know, you've been spending most of your ammo fighting all these fucking bosses, it's a bit annoying, you know what I mean? It's a bit kind of like, are you serious? You know what I mean? Like, this doesn't make the game, like, fun difficult. It just kind of makes it annoying difficult. But... Again, it's a really minor gripe. It's it's not it's not really like a big deal, but it's kind of like I can see why a lot of, you know I can see why people would be put off by that. But that is something to bear in mind if you're if you're new to Resident Evil or at least this this game anyway. Um, the second playthrough is is quite bad. I'd say you got to save your ammo way more in the second playthrough than you do on uh, the first one. So it, that's something to bear in mind if you if you get this game. And I would I'd, I'd highly recommend even someone who's not a fan of Resident Evil. I mean, I remember this. I remember making this case when uh, this game came out uh, way back when 
you know, last year, I, I said to people, look, you know, if you're not even, even if you're not a fan of Resident Evil, you know, get this game. It's a good game. It's a fucking really, really good game. Uh, oh, fuck me. Um, and I'm not actually sure how many of my friends actually did in the end, or how many people I know actually did get this game. I think I was probably, like, one of the very few people who did. But, yeah, like, it's the same with, like, kind of Spider-Man as well. Like, I was one of the first people to buy it, and then, like, I wouldn't say everybody jumped the bandwagon, but, I mean, people were, like, people saw it and, like, oh, well, this game looks pretty fucking cool. Same with God of War as well. Uh, I'm still trying to convince a few people to play that, because, I mean, the game's fucking potent. You know, it really is fucking god tier, and uh, no pun intended there, so, yeah. Uh, yeah, we, okay, whatever, I don't care if it spurs a dangerous solution. Go fuck yourself. <laughs> nah, I think Mr. X comes along here, I think. X, go, we'll give it to you. Go and give it to you. Now oh, what? That was a... Fuck you. I think he comes along. Oh, maybe he doesn't. Okay, maybe he yeah, actually... Oh, nice. I know you do get attacked by a lot more vine monsters, though. Because there's another one here. Uh, I think there's one through here as well, actually. There's not? Okay, sick. He's, he's fucked off. Oh no, never mind. Way. Oh shit! Fuck you. Okay. Burn, motherfucker. I want that knife back. Come on. Our weapon's not burning already. Oh. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh. Is that knife already broken? Oh, maybe it was. Okay. Oh, this knife was, like, on its way out. Right, fuck it, doesn't matter. <laughs> Cock it. Alright. Nice. Just go the wrong way on. That's fucking... That's what you need. Where's my wrist man? There it is. Alright, so we can go open this shit up. Alright. High priority. Alright, fuck you. Don't care. Oh. Some fucking destroying the place outside. Sick. That's what you want. Now, uh, I need to go through here, don't I? And go into the fucking... Actually, you know what? I'll go back and put some of this shit in my chest. Because I'm probably going to need the space. I mean, it's a good thing I got all the the hit pouches when I did, to be honest. Because um, it's always it's something I've always done in all my playthroughs. I tried to get all the hit pouches because it seriously really helps you towards the end of the game like you may not think it when you're you're sort of going up to the lead up to the game but uh towards the end and that but trust me you really really do you need all the space you can get um because it's just mad like on top of all the ammo you have with all the healing items you have and um not to mention the the quest items you need as well to to fucking you know uh progress to the game it's pretty fucking insane. You've got to get quite a lot. But, again, it's not that bad. It really isn't that bad, to be honest. It's actually, uh, it's it's pretty fucking, it's pretty decent. So, but again, it, it, as long as you get all the hit pouches, you're pretty much fine, really. You really are absolutely fine. You really don't need to worry that much at all. You really just have to worry about having enough ammo, having enough healing items, and all these sort of stuff. Right. Where the fuck did the... Uh... It's through here, isn't it? Wait, hey. I mean, I kind of think, if zombies are really that close to Sherry, how are they not, like, you know, walking through here? I mean, I know they are quite docile on that, but, I mean, you kind of think they they be like, oh, oh, nice, some free lunch, sick. I thought I fucking took you down, asshole. Maybe I didn't. I would have thought I shot him in the head as well. Can't regenerate that fast, did he? Alright. M-U-F. Because I think there is a hip pouch in here, actually, I think. If I remember correctly. Oh. Oh, God. There we go. Hey, hey. Sick. Modded. Yeah. Mm. He's down. And there's no ammo in here. Cool. I thought there was actually some ammo in here, but no, it's just it's just a hit pouch. So, uh, I think that's all the hit pouches I've got as well, actually, to be honest. I think I've pretty much got everything, so... Uh, which is quite potent. I was actually, um, because I remember when I, when I started this playthrough, I thought, oh shit, you know, should I get all the stuff? Should I try and get as much as I can humanly possibly get? Because I thought, I want to make this as easy as possible for me. Um, and, and mainly for more enjoyable for you guys, because I, you know, I like to hope that you, if, when you guys watch this, if you are thinking about getting this game or you're on the fence about getting this game, hopefully this will 
kind of um, spur that decision on, I hope. Um, but again, I can only just hope, so, yeah. yeah. But I would recommend to anyone who uh, who wants, you know, a good game. It has a lot of replay value as well. This game has an incredible amount of replay value. So, you know, it's not particularly long as such. I mean, I, I'm not actually sure how many parts this, this series is going to come out to in the end. But it's not a particularly long game. However, it is really, there's a lot of replay value. And I, again, I would recommend and urge anyone to um, to play it and buy it. So, and you can get really cheap now. So, I'd recommend getting it, to be honest. It's, uh, I'm pretty sure it was on sale not all that long ago. But uh, I'm, I'm pretty sure it's, it's not. That expensive, even full price. I think. Wait, what was it? Was it? Oh, oh yeah, OSS. So I recommend it. I really would. Um, again, I don't know about Resident Evil 3 because I mean, I, I, I'm just glad. You know what I mean? I'm glad I didn't pay full price for it. I, I got it off CD keys. I got it for like 35 note, and I was like, oh fuck yes, I'll get that fucking, a fucking takat. And um, I'm pretty happy I did to be honest because I mean it was one of those things where I was like, right, you know, I don't know how this game is because I, when I heard the rumors that um. It was it wasn't actually being made by Capcom themselves like it, the like like this one this one was actually made by Capcom and everything and, and remit um, it was actually the third one was actually sourced off to another fucking third party uh, fucking game uh, it's, you know, it's under Capcom but it was sourced off to someone else and they they have done they did um, the I think they worked on the first Resident Evil one remake so like. People were quite optimistic, and quite rightly so as well, but I think just the way it turned out, I think, and how much they cut, I, apparently there's a lot of stuff they cut from the game, like they, they cut the clock tower, they cut, you know, Jill going back to the RPD, and, and they had a lot of stuff that they replaced with a lot of stuff that I just feel just didn't work, you know, like, um, for example, the fucking, uh, the, um, I'm just thinking, I'm, not, I'm going the right way, aren't I? Yeah, I am. Uh, I was just thinking, uh, I can't remember if you, you know, because you don't, you don't fight Burke until you come out, uh, come back from here. But, uh, I, I just remember thinking the whole time, I was like, wow, is this really, wait, no, I'm pretty sure there's some more stuff I'm getting here, hang on. But yeah, there's just a lot of stuff, I think, they, they, they could have done that game a lot better, I really do believe that. But, eh, meh, swings and roundabouts, I guess. Um, I always do think this tank is really cool as well, this fucking fish tank. There's just no fish in it, though. Where are the fucking fish at? Where are the fishies? Where are they fucking gone? <laughs> Ooh, oh, there's another one in here. Sick. Um, I mean, I'm gonna need it in a second to be honest. Oh, there are all my stuffs here. Okay. So what I'll do is I'll put that in there. Make some more submachine gun ammo, cause that's always good. I'm just kind of thinking about making some more to be honest, but uh, yeah. Actually, no, no, no. We won't. I think I'll save that in case I need a layer. I don't know, I don't actually know if I'm going to need it again. Like, actually, no, let's just make some more ammo, actually, because, I mean, I've got two. So if I want to make some, like, ass around the can, so at least it's, like, you know, if I get some more gunpowder than that. Right. Oh, shit, is that really how much fucking pistol ammo I've got left? Oh, fuck me. Right, uh, where's the cartridge? That's what I was looking for. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, right, I think I've got everything I need. I mean, oh, actually, no. Uh, let me go put that back in here. I know what I'll... I've been saving these knives for that, this very situation. So, right, I'll, um, I'll switch my acid rounds, because uh, I need to use them first. I'll, uh, that's already been favored, sick. Everything else is all reloaded, so that's all reloaded. Yep, yep. Uh, I'm just sort out my fucking shit a little bit, hang on. Uh, right, I'll put, I'll put the ammo up here. Oh, wait. Put that there, that there. That there. That there. That there. Wait. That there. Shit. <laughs> it's fucked it. Uh, there we go. Right, sick. There we go. It's a bit more organized fucking... Um, Trust me, it does help. Uh, I know, like, it, that may be a little bit, like, OCD, but it does help, trust me. Uh, when you get fucking, sort of, you know, when you're fighting bosses, you don't, don't want to be sitting there fucking trying to constantly try to find shit, because, you know, it's all fucking scattered the mess. Oh, why? Look at that. Yeah, but you look at that. Reincarnation. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. 
All right, sick. Let's get the fuck out of Dodge, yeah. shall we? Antiviral agent. Yeah, no, thank God. Got to get back to Sherry. All right, now we got to fucking fight Birkin. Dirty bastard he is. I think I'm pretty sure it's like the last time you. F no, no, it's not the last time you fight him. Second last time you fight him. Oh shit. Surprise, motherfucker. <laughs> Your ass again. Why? Hmm. Wait, is she using a fucking flare gun? Hmm. I mean, it kind of beats the 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 sort of coolness in Dark Side Chronicles. Oh, lol. You mean, well, I guess, yeah, I suppose, yeah, it was your husband. He's not really necessarily your husband now. <laughs> she is my creation! Mm. Alright, man. Yeah. It's a sort of temper tantrum. <laughs> oh. I mean, why didn't she? I suppose, to be fair, even if she did shoot him there and then, William. I mean, he would have just mutated, wouldn't he, really? So, I mean, eh. But at the same time, it's like, really, in it? I should have killed him while I had the chance. I don't know why, I just. I couldn't do it. Yeah, I suppose, fair enough. Husband. Honestly, we were more married to our work than each other. Mm. But what about Sherry? How could you just leave her all alone while Rackham City burned to hell? <laughs> I couldn't let my daughter grow up in a world with the G virus in it. Mm. So that's no excuse. <laughs> True. It's not an excuse. Oh, fuck. She's about to get crushed. Ooh, savage. You got this, I totally. I just got flung from fucking to the wall. Yeah, nice one. You totally got this. Got this. I got this. <laughs> I got this. <laughs> you should take care of Sherry. You don't know what you're up against. I have a pretty damn good idea. <laughs> Never you do. Don't stop until it's finished. Trust me. I mean, this is also better than spoilers for Resident Evil 3. This is better than the um the Jill fucking you go girl woman yo know, moment where she like has the massive gun. Um, so, like, I, I think this is far more kind of, like, again, I know there's people who are like, oh, it's not realistic that Claire would just jump into battle, but let's be real here. If you talk about realism, it's a fucking game with zombies and, and, and fucking mutated monsters. I really don't think, I think realism is kind of out the window at this fucking point, if I'm being honest with you. But, um, but no, yeah, it's, it's one thing I just didn't like about the whole Resident Evil because it was just, like, and also the massive gun as well, it's like, it's not something that fucking, you know I mean, I'm not trying to sound sexist, but, you know, I don't think Jill fucking is some big, you know, even, I'm sure, like, some big season fucking bodybuilder would struggle to fucking, um, you know, fucking carry the fucking massive weapon that she has. You know, it's just, it's a bit stupid, if I'm being honest, but, meh. Ah, oh, shit, okay. That didn't work. <laughs> Whoa, you fucking son of a bitch. Yay, fucking prick. I forgot he jumps on you, to be honest. I actually did kind of forget about that. Ha! Nice. Nice fucking movement of the leg there. Koali. Bitch. Bitch! Suck it. Come on, you asshole. Whoa! Whoa! Fuck me. Whoa, Nelly. Ooh, Nelly! Oh, shit. Come on, bitch. Bitch! What? Did that just, like, literally, like, gravitate me, like, towards his fucking hand? I know that kind of does it sometimes. Oh, my lord. Come on, shut a fucking eyeball of yours, you fucking ugly bastard. Oh, I need the one behind you. 
I mean, that's really probably the one I should really go for the most first. I think kind of just get that out of the way. Um. Oh, fuck you, you fucking ugly cunt. Uh, okay, let me see if I can throw a grenade at him. Bitch. Oh! Shit! They dodged the grenade! What a fucking madman. Well, mad monster? I don't know. Oh. Uh. Ah, shit. Mutate. You son of a fucking bitch. Whoa. Come on, suck it. Go down already, fucker. Come on. Ha! Juked. Just got fucking wrecked, son. Boom. Ah, oh, yes! You just got done in. Absolutely fucking wrecked. There you go. Well earned sip of the old fucking drink. It's just water, by the way. <laughs> it's not like anything fucking mental. Ending quarantine. I wish they were down the quarantine right now. <laughs> right. <clears throat> Get all the fucking ammo. They, actually, to be honest, that was kind of the reason why I don't... I try not to use all the ammo around here, because you, you do scurry about trying to fucking collect it all, and, you know, you got Birkin on your fucking ass, like, 24 fucking 7. So, it's one of those things that, like, it's best to kind of wait till afterwards, but... There you go, I'm a bit seasoned at this game now, a bit of a seasoned veteran, I suppose. So, uh, you know, I fucking, I can play this, you know, just get all the ammo I need, and then fucking, boom, I'm done, so. Oh, yeah, I've got this first aid spray here, isn't it? Sick. And some more pistol ammo. That's fucking perfect. 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 Alright. Where's that fucking lift? There we go. Way, spazzy bastard. <laughs>